Well, it's the end of the month, and that means YouTube check time. So, I used some of the money and spent it on a relatively large box. And inside this box is... And open it. All new plastics for the RM80. Some more in the box, actually. Front fender there. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. We got the front fender, uh, side covers, uh, radiator shroud, and uh, rear fender. Yeah, I decided if I got new plastics for it, it would make the you know, dirty old faded plastics. Uh, Replacing these new ones and make it look quite a bit nicer and because I was showing off to some small Mexican children and I did a wheelie a bit too hard and the bike fell back and I broke this fender Should held on with zip ties there so yeah, I'm gonna strip this thing down and uh, You know clean it up really good and then put these new plastics on they should be relatively just bolt in I see a bit of an issue with the front fender because the, there's no holes drilled in it But I can probably just drill those no problem using the, uh, the old one as a template. So yeah, let's strip the bike down and uh, get her done. Well, the bike's good and stripped down now, and you'll see that uh, I've added an air box, a new air box, and a uh, new snorkel cheech thing that goes to the carburetor, because I was riding around with this no-toil piece just strapped right onto the carburetor, and I gotta say, and this is the, the, my, my official opinion of these no-toil filters, they're garbage, they don't stop anything. I look inside the carburetor, just tons of mud and sand and shit. They don't stop anything. They're garbage. Here, we'll see inside it now. Look, look how much dirt and crap there is in that. It's just ridiculous. So, yeah. I switched back to the old assembly. I had the box, but I had to get the, the little snorkel piece there. And I'm waiting on the foam interior piece to come. But I got it cleaned out all real good, so that's cool. And I got the mud guard back on. So now I'm going to go ahead and uh, put on the plastics. I'm going to do the the side panels, the seat, and the, the uh, rear fender, and we're going to see how that looks. Hopefully it looks pretty sick, and then after that I'll move on to the front fender and the radiator shroud. Awesome. Well, here it is, with all new plastics on. Looks pretty sick. Yeah, it looks real nice. They're a bit different than the old plastics in their design, but they still look pretty awesome. Let's go ahead and fire it up. It hasn't been started in a few days, but it should start right up. Cold start, eh? Cold start, oh, yeah. Old cold start. Some misfires or something, what it's called. That's great. 
Yeah, these new plastics definitely added a few kilowatts for sure. Thanks for watching.